Hi there, and welcome to another session of Tips and Tricks with Lynn Allen. Today we're going to talk about a very cool command that came out inside of AutoCAD 2008. And those of you who don't have 2008 are going to be very jealous when I show you this really cool command. This command comes in handy if you've ever received a drawing from somebody else who just totally didn't get that whole layer standards thing, and your job was to try to fix it. Let me show you what I mean. First of all, I just want you to notice that every single layer in this drawing is gray. Okay, you would never do that, but I'm just have it set this way to help illustrate a point. As I zoom in on this drawing, you'll see that not everything in the drawing is gray. Consequently, somebody broke some rules, right? Somebody drew objects that were not set to by layer. We've all been there. If I take a look at this particular magenta object, I go over to properties. Sure enough, it has a color assigned to it and it has a line type assigned to it. Definitely rules were broken. Some of you CAD managers out there are squirming even as I show that to you, right? Okay, that's bad. Now, I could fix that. It would not be that hard to fix that situation. I could highlight all the objects in the drawing, and I could drop this list down and set it to by layer. I could go into properties. Um, whatever the situation, I could correct that pretty quickly. The problem arrives when we run into something like a block. Not so easy to fix that. So this is a magenta block. If Excuse me, it's a cyan colored block. If I move over to the properties dialog box, it tells me it's by layer. It tells me uh, that it should be gray, right? It's a liar, it's not by layer. <laughs> so somewhere in there, inside the block definition, there are objects that are not by layer. Or even worse, you might run into a situation where you have a nested block and the objects in there are not by layer. And it, let's say it's your job to fix it, well, that's not gonna be pretty. That's gonna be very tedious, it's not gonna be much fun. So you are going to absolutely love this new feature, this new command called set by layer. Okay, I'm gonna select all, I'm just gonna do an all to select all of the objects in the drawing. You could also do a control A, that would also select everything in the drawing. And uh, change by block to by layer, absolutely, yes. Include blocks, including those nested blocks, absolutely, yes. And take a look at my drawing, you will see that everything is gray and the world is a beautiful place. So one other thing, you might notice when I went in there that there was a settings option. You may find yourself in a situation where you don't want to change all the properties of the objects to by layer, so you do have some options here, something for you to think about when you're using this command. So if you went into the situation again, pull out this great tool set by layer. It's going to save you lots of time, lots of tedious work, and it's going to make you a happy AutoCAD user. So have a great rest of the week, and I'll talk to you next week.